as they say in the great classic movie Anchorman. 75% of the time, it works all the time. All right, guys, so it happened again. Riding the damn lawnmower, hit a tree stump, hit a rock, and now you get the crazy lawnmower haircut thing going on where you get the high spots, the low spots, you're lopping off dirt, right? And uh, not good. So what do you do? Well, you have a couple options. One, buy a new lawnmower. Don't do that. That costs a couple thousand bucks. Bad idea. Um, second option is do what I'm doing here. Um, typically what I found when I do this is my lawnmower blades are typically like slightly bent and um, also the spindles sometimes get bent. So it's kind of like a combination of two things that you need to check out and I'll show you how to fix it right here. So let's take a look. Um, number one, you're gonna find out no deck, right? Deck. Strongly suggest taking the deck off and uh, makes it a, a lot easier to work. I've tried to do this stuff with the deck on and it's an absolute pain in the rear end, so take the deck off. The other thing you want to do is, like I said, <clears throat> old lawnmower blade, probably bent, probably this, probably that. Get rid of it, buy a set of new lawnmower blades. That's what I did. Um, these ones cost me about 40 bucks, not cheap, but at least you know you're starting off with uh, straight lawnmower blades, right? So if you have a straight lawnmower blade and you put a, a straight lawnmower blade onto your spindle, it should be good to go and if it's cocked off it's not level it's not straight the only other thing you can have going on there is your deck or your spindle is bent so that's where i'm at right now so put the new lawnmower blade on okay and what i typically do is i kind of spin it around and i check it with the edge of the deck and you can see that this basically completely parallel same deal here right completely parallel so um, and I know for a fact that I hit a rock on this side and this is the side that's causing me the the bad haircut symptoms right so what I need to do is work on this side so thing you can do show you guys here I'll put this put this blade back on tighten it up and just finger tight. You guys are gonna see the edge of the blade here. Actually, when I started, it was about down here, okay? So I've actually hit this with my uh, two pound hammer, three pound hammer, whatever it is, couple pound hammer, and uh, trying to bend this this way back into shape. So that's, that's kind of the game here. Um, the other thing that you can do is try to kind of whack the deck, like right back here, hit that down. Because I know it's tilted down that way and I'm trying to bend it up so um, I can hit the spindle and if you hit the spindle make sure you have the nut on the spindle okay do not whack the threaded part of the spindle and you'll destroy the threads and then you'll cry and then you'll be mad put the nut on there before you whack it with a hammer and then like I said you can pound the, the deck as well so I'll, I'll show you guys how that works and try to bend this thing back into place let's take a look at that Take the blade off. Put the nut on. Start whacking. I usually like to have a flat kind of on the side that I'm whacking it on so you can. The thing you can also do is whack the deck here. So I'm going to whack. This part of the deck, again, I'm trying to essentially tilt this thing up this way, so I'm going to hit down on that, try to bend the deck back, and I'm trying to whack the spindle here as well. Two different things to bend the deck downwards or kind of like this way to make this level. So give it a couple whacks here. Let's check it out. All right, so you can see getting a lot closer there right with this being level with the deck um, the other thing I like to do is on this side kind of check out the high sides of the blade together and you can see that that's that when I started that was about three quarters of an inch away now it's about 
probably a quarter of an inch away, so I'm gonna keep whacking at this thing. Get All right, this guys. Thing I've beaten the absolute schnitzel out of the lawnmower deck. All right, so this is where we're at right now, guys. So, you can see on this side, probably off by like an eighth of an inch. Over here, again, probably about an eighth of an inch. Um, I'm beating this thing like it owed me money. Um, what I'm gonna do is just wrap it up. Uh, being an eighth of an inch off, as they say, close enough for government work. I guess close enough for lawnmower work or whatever. Anyways, I'm gonna tighten up the blades on the deck, put the deck back on, mow the damn lawn. Hopefully this helps you. Thanks guys. Mower's back together, and this is some of the, the damage I was telling you guys about. All right. Just skin there, right, because my blade was bent, my deck was bent off by probably about an inch when I started, so let's give this a shot, see how this works. 